Did you know who I seen just the other day? Uh, what's that guy's name? He played on Boston. Paul Pierce. No. Flim. 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 Boston Flim. Uh, yeah, he, he he was a little bit heavy, and he was doing the same thing. The baby? And that's Big like, baby? No, it wasn't Big Baby. Big Baby's still playing in, in Ice Cube's League. Yo, Ice Cube's League is, is nice, eh? The three-on-three -three thing? And it's bringing back a lot of these old players. Yeah, yeah, play. yeah. They play the them. NBA don't want them. Yo, Brian Scalabrini's like a star down there, guy. Remember Brian Scalabrini? Yes, I do. Yo, my guy. Yo, he's he talks pure shit, man. I like that guy. And the funny thing is, is the NBA is hating on Ice Cube. Man, they're trying, you know to, they're why? trying to push him down. Because they're like, they see that he's taking these ex-players yeah. who still want to play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, they might be over the hill, but they can still ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he's rejuvenating their careers. Yeah. He's giving them something. Because remember... And they're playing three on three. They're not running up and yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. You know, like, it's half court. Yeah, half court thing. You know, like, it's nice. You know who was killing it? Was uh, Joe something. What was his name? Dumars? No. <laughs> That's too <laughs> Joe Dumar, yeah, Drew, he's like rolling. 80. Joe Dumar is 80 right now. I know, uh, I know you're talking about. I know he played on so many different teams. Yeah, he, he was like he's tick, tick and square. Like like he, he's killing it. Yeah, 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 he was good. Well, he was good in the NBA. Like he was, it, he was killing us so much that he actually got uh, tryouts. Like other teams are asking him to come work out with. Him. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm like, oh. what the fuck is his name, Joe? Flim. Joe Flim. Flim. You guys know who we're talking about too, man. He's like, he played on like fucking seven different teams and he was always like, just that second tier impact player. He was, yes. He was never like a star He's star. never. I know exactly who you're talking about. He's not top, but he was like, he was your number two scorer. Yeah, he was like that second tier and he would always drop 20, 20 something. Right? Yeah, yeah. Sometimes he'd hit like a 35, right? Like, yeah. Uh, fuck, what the fuck is his name? Yeah, well, there? you know what? Oh, they, Muthana is in there? Hey, what do you want me to answer you? She's like, answer me. You know? Oh, thoughts on Ben Simmons being out for the season? Yo. What thoughts? That shit is what the so I, fucking hilarious. Did I didn't even know he was still playing. When when has he ever played a full season? <laughs> and he was supposed to be the next best thing. Right? Yo, this guy, yo, I know I get it. Okay, you know what? Some what number was he picked? Was he picked one? Was he I don't remember. I don't he was know. high. I'd have to look that up. He was a so, high lottery pick. Yo, can you look that up for us? Uh, he was a high lottery I don't pick. know where he was, but he was supposed to be. Yeah, he's supposed to be the next thing. But, yo, I, you know, I can't say nothing about mental health. There's something about mental health. But, yo, like, don't be in the NBA then. Like, what the fuck are you doing in the NBA then? You went and you signed that $80 million or $100 million, contract, whatever you did. Yeah. And then you just go mental the mental health route, and now you're, then you're too much pressure. I can't do this. I can't think. I can't. You did Dude, they would just not cover him, and he would not shoot. And then he would drive to the rim, right at the side of the rim. Nobody there for a layup and pass. You know, like because he, he's afraid. Yo, but afraid of what? <laughs> of himself, because he knows he's dude. But he wasn't dude. dude when he first came in. We couldn't shoot. He was like, I thought he was like almost like yeah, but whatever. You could get around that being so tall and whatever. Just he beat everybody in the room. He was kind of like. A Penny Hardaway that couldn't shoot. You know what I mean? That was that was sort of his game. He was running things when he first came. I wouldn't say. But what, then the fucking guy. Listen. He has a fucking place. Listen. You know he, what? He was over. Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons to me is is on the fucking pum pum. I was gonna say yeah yeah. Yeah you know what? Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons made the pum pum list at the end of the show because you brought that shit up. Now I'm angry. Thank you though for bringing it up because. That's a good thing to address right now because Ben Simmons just today I got I read the report today that he's out for the season again with something with something else. Listen, like I didn't know he was playing. Fuck, man. Just like, like I, I'm surprised this guy's still in the league. I guess they I guess they got a they're trying to put him out there because yeah. he's got a contract, right? Well, just like I, I watched the game the other day. Fuck this guy. Um, the Raptors were playing Zion. Yeah, we got dummy by forty. Yeah, we lost by like, forty. Zion's actually playing good. Yeah. You know, despite all him being uh, too fat. Yo, yeah. Thomas says first overall over Brandon Ingram and Jalen Brown. That's what I'm saying. He was wow. a first pick guy. He was first pick. Nutty. Imagine getting Ingram or Brown guy. That's what I'm saying. You know? And Jamal Murray. Jamal, you drafted him before Jamal Murray now too. He's making $30 million a year. Why? Yo, it's the contract he signed before all this stupidness started, guy. Like, who, who, who? 
The Sixers? Was it the Sixers who gave him the contract? And then they traded him? Yeah, I think so. I think it was the Sixers who gave him the contract. The Sixers were like, we're going to fuck somebody over. <laughs> or was it Brooklyn? Did Bro- did he go- was he Brooklyn first, then Sixers? No, no, no. He started Sixers first, then to Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he was with uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. NB. Yeah, yeah. And then, he- and, then, and the Raptors took advantage of them that year. Remember? Because like he, that was the time when he started to pull back for some reason. Because I don't think the Raptors could have beat Philly if Ben Simmons was playing the way that he played like two years before. Dude, you know? If the Raptors didn't hit that shot, they weren't winning. I'm telling you. Oh, of course. Well, obviously, if it was going to over- overtime, they would the, they would have won. It was done. Philly was on a roll at that time. But yes, hey, you're, sometimes you just get lucky. So, like sometimes it takes a little bit of luck to fucking win too, hey, right? I tell people all the time, we weren't supposed to win. They were setting it up for everybody: the Bucks, the Philly, uh, Golden State. Uh, who else? Or- Orlando. Like Orlando. Yeah. They wanted us to lose Orlando bad. Orlando? I think that was the first. Yeah, yeah the first team we played. Yeah, we yeah we just God, didn't we you slept, hear we them? Orlando, right? But they were like, it was. I felt they thought we were gonna lose Orlando. Yeah, like the all the commentators like, the Raptors can't beat Orlando. Yeah. I'm thinking, Orlando, Orlando, like and yo, we had a fucking all star team. That's guys. what I'm saying. Kyle Lowry, Kawhi Leonard, fucking Siakam, Van Vliet. You, you know they didn't want us to win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were stacking the deck. The refs were making all the calls against us, but you know what it was? Yeah. We just fucking played better yeah, yeah, yeah. than everybody else. You know what happened getting into the Philly series and stuff like that, though? Uh, the Kawhi effect happened. We started getting a lot of calls. There was, there was, I was watching the Philly series, and I'm like, yo, I don't, I can't even be mad at the calls right now. They're going to Raptors way. And I was like, that's not a foul, but they gave Kawhi the foul. You know, there was stuff that was going on when the, and, and the Raptors, when the Raptors were winning, and I was like, because Holy shit, this is how it feels to be a superstar. This is how it feels when your team is getting the, the shit calls. Yeah. You know, like, like because, yo, Philly was complaining. Remember Ben Simmons got a tech because they called his foul. Ben Simmons walked to the stands and sat in the front row. And, it, it, you know, he was he didn't touch Kyle Lowry. I think it was against, I think it was against Kyle Lowry. Yeah. He didn't touch him and they called foul. And he, he, got, he was so mad, but he didn't say anything. But he sat down in the front row seat beside some lady. Yeah. And the ref's like, bleep, tech, give him a tech. Yeah. You know? I was like, yo, I was like, yo, this is how it feels to have a superstar on your team. Right. And now the calls are going my way. Because, yo, it wasn't a foul. And, and that And it started happening. And I was like, I'm sitting there, I'm like. Because I think. Yo, pure shithead green. I was like, yo, we're. No, yo, no. Ka- it's only the Kawhi effect. Because as soon as yeah. he left, the ref said, fuck Toronto. I, I think. Yeah. The refs wanted the Sixers to win it. In seven. Yeah. That we, was game seven. I know, but we fucked it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because Kawhi wasn't supposed to hit that he shot, wasn't supposed guy. To hit the shot. They're yeah, just yeah. like, oh, they're like overtime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just went overtime. Yeah. And then he hit the shot, and yeah. then it was but like... There was bad calls that game, too, to, to help. Yeah. Maybe not bad calls, but there were calls. I yeah, like I'm saying. Because I don't think that game was unfair in terms of calls when I watched no. it. I remember watching that game, and I thought it was pretty even. This is the thing. The refs weren't helping at that point. This, this is the thing, though. When you're playing good, there's nothing the rest can do yeah, 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 yeah. to affect the game. If yeah. you're hitting your shot, yeah. how can they call foul? Yeah, and if you're going to the rim hard. Not even going, we were hitting our shots, so it wasn't it like... But they were. Pascal was scoring inside. Yeah, so we were getting all... They were making their shots, basically. Yeah, they were making their shots. But they went to the free throw line. Like it, was a, it, was a, it, was a, it wasn't like a totally disparaging free throw thing. Like it's not no, like, no, I'm not saying it was. It was I, decent both ways. I was like, holy shit, this game is actually just a good game. And yeah. it's, you're right, the Raptors played so good that the refs couldn't affect it. Yeah, it couldn't affect yeah, it. Yeah, and yeah. that's the thing about when you're playing, if you're that on, I feel like it was like Michael Jordan. You know, the refs couldn't affect the game the other team. when this guy is dropping like 25 in the fourth so hold quarter. On. Muthana said, Brooklyn is a funny franchise. They said they wanted to build around a 30-year-old... Mikael Bridges, who's also a role player on any other team, did they did they not trade Bridges or or are they still are they still building around him? And yeah, I don't um, know nothing about Brooklyn. Brooklyn, yeah. Well, Brooklyn is that Brooklyn is just this Brooklyn is like the Toronto of the of the league down there. Like nobody gives a fuck about Brooklyn and stuff down there unless you're from the area. Yeah, you know, like way back when they had Garnett and Pierce, they tried to bring the Celtics team to them. They got Garnett and Pierce and. And Ray Allen, didn't they? 
Did they no. have all three of them or just Garnett and Pierce? Just Garnett and Pierce because Ray okay. Allen went to Miami. Right, 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 right. Yeah, right. yeah. But, um... And that's why Garnett hates him. Oh, yeah, because he went down there? Well, I seen something where all the players were coming in and when it, they crossed each other, they didn't shake hands. They didn't even shake hands? Did nothing, it just... Cause, oh, it was like the greatest of all time thing, the top 75 year. But he's I remember still, that, that top 75. But he's still sour because he left and went to Miami. And, and went won, to and a bunch of chips down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It'd be sour, man. Come on, man. So, like, mm-hmm. I like Garnett, though. Like, Garnett, you know, Garnett stick to his guns. He talks pure shit, and if he doesn't like you, fuck you. He doesn't like you. That's it. Garnett's one of the all-time shit talkers of the fucking thing. Yes. I won't say, like, he's the greatest... No. But he's up there in the all time. He never stopped talking. Ever, ever, so, ever. I have a good Garnett story. Go. So Garnett is talking about how back in the day, and he's playing the Spurs, and he was like, he's trying to get in Duncan's head. Yeah. And he was like talking all this shit to Duncan, and Duncan just looked through him like. Yeah, oh yeah, I think I heard this story. Garnett, Garnett does it. Garnett says, uh, Duncan, a, Duncan turned to me and went, he just did this. Right? So then, watch it. So he's trying to talk shit, talk shit. They go down the court. Duncan gets the ball. Fucking does turn around bank, bank shot. shot. As they're walking up. Good defense. Good defense. It taps him on the butt. Yeah. And Garnett was like, the fuck? Yeah, 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 <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking shit to this guy. Yeah. And he comes down and just I think wrecks dropped, me. I think he dropped a 40 on him that day, too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, He's like, yo. He gave him 40 that day, too. He wrecks me. He was trying to talk pure shit. And this guy's and like. Duncan, Duncan gave him 40. It's a good game. Yeah. Or he's like. Yeah, he kept saying. No, or no. Good or, D. Good defense. Good D. Yeah. How would you feel if mm-hmm. every time someone wets you up? Yeah, yeah, Good defense. Good defense, man. Yeah. And you're talking shit to them yeah, the whole yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yo. Duncan Yo. is like the ultimate troll. Yeah, yeah. Because it's like... He just did this. Duncan just did this, guys. He's a... Yeah. It, I, sorry, I turned to TikTok live for a second and gave him the, the, the blank stare. And and you blink, you blink like every four seconds. You just keep look staring at somebody and blinking at them. We have to blink long. You have to do, <laughs> you have to do one of these. Do a long blink. Like, yeah. <laughs>